Hello YouTube and welcome to a, another video on my channel. Um, this one here, I uh, kind of want to talk about some of the things that I've just kind of learned along the way that will be uh, helpful to those who are uh, getting out of the military and uh, joining the trucking industry. Things I've uh, found make life a lot easier. Um, mostly has to do with apps and I'll tell you about the app and I'll tell you why. And if you get these before you get out of school, and you hit the, hit the ground running. If not, just kind of download them along the way. Um, it'll save you some time, save you some money. First one, uh, Trucker Path. I'm not sponsored by this company. I'm not sponsored by any of these companies. Hell, I've got nine subscribers. Why would I be sponsored by anybody? But I use Trucker Path. So, uh, a Rand McNally GPS will cost you anywhere from $200 to $500, depending on what model you get. And that's a lot of money to drop right out the bat, especially when you don't know if you're going to like this job or not. I know a lot of guys who spent two or three months in a truck said, nope, I'm done. Two or $400 for three months of employment ain't that great. But... Uh, the Trucker Path app, it has a uh, membership or a sponsorship, a paid premium service like Spotify would or does, and it gives you truck GPS. It also shows you truck stops with, uh, there's enough people using it where pretty much live parking updates. So as you're cruising down the road, you look at, look, uh, okay, you're you're close to your uh, receiver, you're close to your shipper, you're almost out of hours, you can look, okay, this truck stop, it's green, it's got lots of parking, oh, it's yellow, it's got some parking, it's red, there's no parking available, just keep on trucking. It, it, it works really good for that, and I use it a lot for that. Um, so, like I said, no, this isn't a paid, paid membership or paid advertisement for them, but I highly recommend this app it'll save you a ton of time. Uh, next one, cat scale locator. So I use my company credit card to pay for all my uh, cat scale. So you, there's two cat scale apps. One, you can weigh your truck and pay with your card. I don't use that one because why pay for something to get reimbursed when I can just have somebody else pay for it. But the locator, anytime you load up, you need to... Uh, Throw it, run your truck over a scale, make sure everything's adjusted properly, make sure they didn't put you overweight, and make sure that you can balance the load. So, uh, cat scale locator, it'll show you every or base, you know, use your location and tell you, okay, the nearest scale is over here, and you bounce over there. Then the uh, next one kind of goes hand in hand with that is uh, slide calc. It's a calculator. After you run your truck over a scale, you punch in your numbers into this app and it'll tell you where you need to move your tandems to or where you need to move your fifth wheel to. It'll balance the load for you and make sure you stay legal. So I uh, highly recommend that one. And the last one, it's uh, a little bit harder to judge which, which ones you will need, but all of your major truck stops have apps and they have reward programs. So I've got four different rewards cards right here. Now with these rewards, every time you go fill up at truck stop, you swipe your company uh, fuel card, you swipe your, your rewards card, and you get points. You also get shower credits, so you don't have to pay for showers. And these points build up most uh, companies at the rate of uh, about one cent per dollar. But as much gas you put in these wells, as much diesel as you put in these trucks, you build up points quick. I think I've got like, I've been driving for three weeks and I've got $20 on my uh, Love's Car. You know, run that for a few months and that $400 GPS that you didn't want to come out of pocket for, basically you can buy it on points. So make sure you find out who your company uh, has or fuels with and get those cards build those points, get those free showers. Because most of these places, they're charging anywhere from 10 to $15 for a shower. And if you're like me and you want to shower every day, that'd get real expensive real quick. Um, 
Another thing, in addition to uh, using uh, Trucker Path, Google Maps. When you find out where you're going, jump on Google Maps, search the address, and find the little dot that has a business. Punch on that dot, go read the reviews. A lot of truckers leave reviews and they'll say, okay, uh, don't show up early, or they allow parking on the street, you know? Like last night, uh, I'll use that as an example. Last night, I got to Houston later than I wanted to because of a chain of events that was a late loaded trailer two days ago in Iowa. So I was behind the power curve the entire time. Got to Houston late, all the truck stops fill up around three o'clock in Houston. So, jump on there, look at their Google review. They allow parking on the street. I get there, there's not a single truck on the street. Parked first in line this morning, and I pulled my 10 right there on the road, right outside my location. So, I woke up 15 minutes before my appointment time, did my pre-trip inspection, rolled through the gate, got unloaded. Now I'm at my second stop, two hours early for it. So read those reviews, and if something changes while you're driving, post a review. I post a review at the place I'm at right now. I mean, the parking lot on this place is tighter than a dolphin's asshole. It's freaking watertight. So, you know, make sure people know that. You know, I pulled right in the gate here, and they yelled at me. Oh, go back your truck out. So I had to back my truck out through a maze because they let the civilian vehicles park anywhere and there's pretty much no room for truck parking in here. So I had to back out this maze, go park on the street, just to walk in, give them my paperwork, and have me pull back in. Then I had to do like 927,000 pull-ups to get backed into the uh, door because it's tight. So read those reviews, post those reviews, uh, share that information. So... Uh, like I said, um, this is just kind of my adventure. I'm going to continue to post information for guys going through the truck, uh, Troops Transportation Program. That's a program I went through, and one of the things I missed the most about being in the Army was mentoring and coaching younger soldiers. So if I can mentor and coach guys that are getting out of the Army and coming into this industry... I will. So, uh, if this information is useful to you, make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. As I come up with uh, more things that I think guys should know, I'll uh, make videos. Maybe uh, one of these days I'll get me another or a better laptop on the uh, truck so I can edit some videos and show more than just me sitting in the uh, driver's seat talking. And, uh, like I said, keep on trucking hit that like button hit that subscribe button and if you know somebody who's going through the troops transportation program uh hit that share button uh send them my way they uh could probably use this information as well all right thanks bye